What's up, Wayne Baron here with DogFX.net, and once again, we are inside of Edge Reflow. This is by Adobe, one of their new products. And what we're going to be doing here is we're going to be adding some images. So the first thing we want to do is let's go ahead and save our project that we've got here. So save as we're going to name it four. Okay, now what we're going to do here is that we're going to click on this right here, which is add an image. But first, let's go ahead and add in a box and this is going to be our image box so we're going to duplicate this by hitting control D we're going to put it right here control D again and we're going to put this one right there okay now what we're going to do here so we're going to click on add an image and we're going to come over here to our images folder and we go inside of KISS, and we're going to grab a hold of a KISS image. We're going to click right there, then it's automatically going to insert it inside of that div. And then also, while it's inserting it inside of your project, it will also put it inside of the, let's go ahead and save changes. It's going to also put it inside of the folder that you created. For your project so we go inside of four assets images go down here and there is our image choose view uh, large icon and as you can see it's the same image so let's click on this one and let's insert another image we're going to choose this one from the creatures of the night and we just click somewhere inside of the div that you got and it will automatically drop it in there. Well, no it didn't. It didn't do right, did it? <laughs> Why didn't it do right? Okay, let's... Yes, I am learning this program as we go here. <laughs> so, uh... That's weird. I mean, this one right here inserted itself, and it was about the same size. So I reckon what we got to do here is that we've got to scroll this one down to about like so. Okay, then once again, let's add in one more image, and we're going to grab a hold of... Uh, let's get this one right here. That sounds about right. Okay. I see I clicked right there and it made it smaller, but it put it in the wrong place. Let's choose the image, grab it, drag it over here, and there it goes. So I don't know why this one right here didn't do right. I mean, they, like I said, I mean, this is a new program, so there still is some bugs in it. And so, but you should be able to bring the image in and click inside of the div that you want the image to be in, and it should automatically resize it to fit within that div. And so, uh, each one of them go up like so. And um, so, I mean, it's it's pretty simple to bring in images so anyway that's how you bring in images and uh, hopefully uh, within the next couple of uh, uh, releases they should have it to where it automatically just uh, attaches itself inside the div just like this first one did and like the last one attempted to do and so but anyway this is Wayne Brown darkfix.net with edge reflow y'all have a rocking week bye bye